Both the Nichibei Times and the Nichibei Foundation has had a history of creating meaningful opportunities for younger folks to get involved in the community. As part of today's fundraiser, we are raising money for the Nichibei Internship Fund so we can continue to offer opportunities for younger folks of the community to gain valuable experience and skills while helping to fulfill the mission of the Nichibei Foundation and Nichibei Weekly. This includes journalism interns, Asian American Studies interns, and interns from the Nikkei Community Internship Program. We are proud of our interns, and actually half of the current Nichibei staff started as interns, once some 15 years ago. I had a great experience as an intern last year because I was able to develop many skills and meet wonderful people in the community. Now you will hear from some former Nichibei interns about the impact of their experience. We hope that you may consider donating to the Nichibei Internship Fund to help support Nichibei's overall mission. My name is Maho Watanabe. I was a former intern at Nichibei Times. I got involved with the Japanese American community and Nichibei Times was um, almost like 20 years ago when I was a journalism student at San Francisco State University. The experience at Nichibei was just amazing. Basically, I could get all the hands-on training and what I enjoyed the most was to get to know the Japanese American history, first of all. While I was working as an intern, it impacted my whole life. I would say it still impacts me, so it's going to be a lifetime memory and also a lifetime treasure to me. So I, after left San Francisco, I actually got on the boat that, that was called Peace Boat. So they're running the world cruise and I was a interpreter on the ship and also at the each places that we visited basically. And after that, I became the Yokohama City's Yokohama Goodwill Ambassador. I was the ambassador for two years. My mission was to basically, well, tell the world that Yokohama is such a beautiful city and everybody should be visiting our city. While I was working as an intern, it impacted my whole life. I would say it still impacts me, so it's going to be a lifetime memory and also a lifetime treasure. And I write for a local magazine called Yokohama Seasider Magazine. That is a bilingual magazine here in Yokohama, but it's distributed basically all over Tokyo and Yokohama Kanto area. And I enjoy writing about local eateries and bars and restaurants, but I also love to interview local people here. Then I also am a radio show host and the radio program is called Yokohama Tonight. We talk about local politics sometimes, baseball, music, and well, I love to talk about the Yokohama local news and everything. So how I use my journalism skill is that basically I need to get the right information, good sources, and the correct information to talk to the listeners and in order to be precise and accurate about what I talk about, I need to do lots of researches and do all the, well, reporting basically. So that kind of basic things I all got from Nichibei, so I'm still thankful for that. Being an intern at Nichibei Times really helped me understand more about the community I was living in. Being a Shin Nisei, a new second generation uh, Japanese American, I actually was not aware of the Japanese American history, especially the internment camps. I've learned a little bit about it at school, but of course, you know, with the textbook, it was just one paragraph. So I didn't really understand um, what our Japantown community went through at that time. So working at Nichibei Times really helped me understand the history of Japanese Americans and also Japanese immigrants pre-war and also to understand the struggles that Japanese immigrants had, especially Japanese immigrants who were immigrating after the war as well. So I think most important lesson I learned um, while interning at Nichibei Times, and it helped me kind of get more involved in the community. I felt kind of not really a part of the community because I was the second generation. You know, a lot of the images of second generation Japanese Americans are were, you know, the older generation. 
so there weren't a lot of younger uh, Jap Japanese Americans, especially second generation Americans like myself. I got to meet more people in our community and I think that really helped me understand more about Japantown um, in general and I definitely miss Japantown very much and also the people in the community. Hi there, my name is Julian Avenilia. I was an Ichibei intern in the summer of 2017 and today I'm asking for your support for this year's Nichibei Day of Giving and especially the Nichibei Weekly Internship Fund. So why is it so important to me? Well, for me, the Nichibei Internship really illustrated the importance of the Nichibei Weekly as well as the importance of participating in the community as a whole. For the Nichibei Weekly, serving as an intern, I really got the opportunity to share information about ones that were happening during the summer, things that were happening in the Japantown community, and things that were happening in the Japanese American community nationwide overall. And this is information that you wouldn't have gotten anywhere else uh, in the Bay Area. So I realized how integral it was to have the Nichi Bay Weekly as a source that could share this information and that in doing so, it really keeps the Japanese American community together. But then in addition to that, on a personal level, the Nichi Bay Weekly internship inspired me to continue to get involved. Because prior to this, I didn't have an Asian American community growing up on the East Coast. So having the Nichi Bay Weekly show me how integral it is to have people participating in whatever way they can, it really helped me just get the confidence and the uh, sense of duty to do that today, uh, even four or five years after participating in the internship. I want other interns to get the opportunity to have this experience as well, so that they continue to lead in their ways. So today I'm asking you to donate, as I will be doing too for this Nichi Bay Day of Giving. Thank you so much, and I hope to see you uh, participate in future Nichi Bay Weekly events and Days of Giving as well. I encourage everyone to support the internship fund. It really does help younger generations, especially to learn more about the community, to learn about their history, and to learn more about what it means to be a Japanese American.